All right. Hello, everyone. I hope you guys are having a beautiful day or evening. So we're going to talk about envisioning today. For those of you watching the replay on the world of YouTube, just to let you guys know, this is a live Zoom. And my name is Jean Collins. And I love to just help people feel better, get to know a little bit more about themselves. Right now we're talking about envisioning and I'm gonna go through some tools and tips and tricks on what to do best to really help you envision the life of your dreams and how um, also essential oils can help really get into that limbic center of the brain, touch into your memory and help you emotionalize and making sure that you're emotionalizing with where it is you're going versus where it is you've been or that old story, right? The stories we tell ourselves. And um, I've been using Young Living Essential Oils since December in 2007. So I've been a product user for quite some time. And they really just helped me with my own envisioning, right? Really imagining as well as um, having the courage. So I'm gonna start with Valor, all of my oily friends. Um, we are going to go over and use valor, harmony, surrender, believe, envision, joy, and motivation for anyone who wants to grab that. So with valor and how you use essential oils is you let the essential oil drop. Valor is a really cool oil because it is really blue. So you let it drop to get um, into your energy field. Some people know, know that as an aura. And... Most of you probably find this or like, oh yeah, I definitely understand energy. But think about if you're like, what do you mean energy? Sometimes you meet some people and you're like, oh my God, this person is amazing. Whereas you met someone else and you're like, I don't, I mean, they seem nice, but uh, someone was a little off. That's you picking up on their energy, right? Um, and essential oils have beautiful energy and valor is really good to help us have that courage and really help us um, be balanced. But we're, we're, for this one, we're gonna kind of go with the courage because we're gonna envision our future, right? We're kind of getting rid of the old, oh, my money tree, I'm gonna move him a little bit. We're, uh, we're getting rid of the old and we're bringing in the new and we're really envisioning some of the things that we desire to have so that we can really live to our full potential and then with living to our own full potential, we uh, will inspire others around us as well. So Valor is a blend of um, vitamin E, or yeah, vitamin E, black spruce, camphor, blue tansy, frankincense, and geranium. So this is, like I said, all of these oils specifically are to help balance and help you with courage. So uh, that is just a, a beautiful thing to get started and enjoy. The next one that also uh, with really envisioning your future and helping you move forward, I like to, uh, and what I've been studying is to think from like, when I've achieved the goal or the goals, right? Because we all have little micro goals from the beautiful people that I've been chatting. Am I really in harmony? Like maybe the results that you are currently getting, like be aware of your thoughts. What are you thinking on a daily basis? How are you thinking about what it is that you want to achieve? Are you thinking it's gonna be really hard? Uh, it's gonna be really stressful. Uh, you're gonna get a lot of resistance because if you're thinking those thoughts, then you're gonna get that, right? That's kind of just how it works. Um, but if you're in harmony with where you're going, Right, and for harmony, I like to take this and apply a drop. And I usually do just use a drop. Delusion for harmony is gonna only be for those that are really sensitive. Um, and I'll apply it on my solar plexus. So right now I have a dress on, so I'm just gonna do a little scent tent, inhale deeply. So I'm kind of doing two ways of application. I've applied it topically. And then I'm also inhaling it, that aromatherapy aspect. Also, you guys can see from my beautiful diffuser that is changing colors, that this is another way of aromatic. This is um, a, a way to diffuse, put it into the air, right? 
or you can smell your hands or you can also just smell directly from the bottle when needed. If you're like, man, my order's coming, my subscription order's coming, I ran out of my Harmony, what did I do? And you just smell in that Harmony until your order comes. Because uh, a lot of the time when we're envisioning, right, we're goal setting, we're not really, um, we're like those thoughts, we're not really in harmony with where it is we're going. We're thinking it's going to be hard. We're, we're maybe a little frustrated because it hasn't happened yet. We're getting a little impatient. So harmony is to help you with that patience. It's also harmonizing all of your chakras, your energy centers. And um, I would really use this and think about your goal and, and, and the actions that you're doing every day right? Making sure that you're doing things every day to achieve and also doing it in the aspect of the person that you are, right? The, per the person that you're technically becoming, but already be that person now, right? Have that, have that mindset now, which Earl Nightingale uh, does a great job on self-image. So that's a great video for you guys to reach out and look up Earl Nightingale on self-image, as well as Bob Proctor has a video on self-image. Um, now, so also the basis of how essential oils are used, and, I, and just imagine if you don't have these oils yet, you we can definitely jump on that train and we'll talk more about that. But imagine, uh, experiencing this. I know that this is essential oils are an experiencing thing, but when you're smelling the essential oils, they're going directly to that limbic center of the brain. And that's, that's to help your heart rate, your memory, your blood pressure, right? When you're smelling them. Also, when it's topically, anything that you're putting on your body absorbs, with, starts to absorb within 30 seconds and is fully absorbed with an hour. So that's why we want to be really aware of what we're applying on our body. That's also why a lot of my other topics are, or I'm gonna mention right now, the toxic free lifestyle. Look at the ingredients, avoid the word fragrance at all costs, because that's how companies hide the ingredients. They don't have to tell you what's in it. So they can put a plethora of toxins in there and you just wouldn't even know. So that's why I love Young Living is we have our beautiful farms. We have over 14 farms internationally. So these are some of the farms. I'm just going to kind of flip through. So I'm not sure what I'm turning turning to, but we have uh, Ecuador. We have a farm in Ecuador. We have three in the United States. One that I've been to is the Mona, Utah farm. And we also are about science sourcing and standards. So we have a lot of science behind our products. Actually, we do have a lot of science behind our products, as well as the sourcing, that's the farms. And I planted, I've planted lavender, um, a helichrysum, a clarity sage, and a uh, yarrow. Oh, and uh, one of the chamomiles. I don't remember if it was German or Roman chamomile. So that was a really cool experience. So that's me planting. And then um, so the greenhouses and just some more of this is the Mona Utah farm. So that's the one that I visited regularly. Um, little little feedback, but they all work also essential oils work on that cellular level when you're physically applying it to the body. So that's why sometimes you have to dilute it with a carrier oil like jojoba or coconut or almond. That's a vegetable oil. Okay, so and you just read the label. Sometimes it is the directions are directly on the back, like first surrender, which is our next oil is surrender. Again, though, apply two to four drops directly to desired area, delusion not required except for the most sensitive skin. But if you're like, well, what's the ingredients? There's this beautiful little peel here and voila, there's the ingredients. Um, and so the ingredients of surrender are lemon, lavender, black spruce, Roman chamomile, angelica, mountain savory, and mat matriciara. You guys can also look all of these ingredients up on my website for those watching the replay below. You can type in and read the ingredients yourself. Everything is on the Young Living website. 
So the reason why I am choosing surrender is because I'm talking about changing our self-image, getting rid of the old paradigm, getting rid of the old programming of the not worthiness, right? Really stepping into our new self. And that can get a little uncomfortable, which is again, why we started with valor and harmony to kind of have that courage and also to harmonize with where we're going and making sure that we, I, I recommend using those oils daily. I use both valor and harmony daily. Uh, surrender, I picked though, to help us to surrender to our new self, to kind of surrender and have faith and trusting the process, right? And, and really tapping into our intuition and really following that intuition. Uh, I highly encourage you guys to really be um, careful and that's why I said earlier to those that are watching live uh, to really be careful. And when you're uh, talking about uh, something new, a, a new goal, not that um, people are trying to do this. Oh, this is also one of the oils that I have to purchase. That was the other thing. Sometimes my order is on the way. So um, you can take off, I just dropped the other lid, but you can take off the Orphis. I don't really highly recommend you touching it, but. I'll show you in a second how to do. And I know I have like five drops in here. So I'm gonna really carefully, this is only for pro essential oilers, take a drop. Um, if uh, you are new to essential oils, doing that, you might drop the whole bottle or all 10, five to 10 drops. I don't know exactly how many drops are left. So with that, um, just be aware because you, for an adult, you only need one to three drops with any of these, one to three drops. So, and each one has a different viscosity. So sometimes essential oils and uh, come out a little thicker. I'll just really show you and then get back to surrender. So you can just squeeze the top and pull off that orifice, that little dropper. Oh. Apparently that skill is, either way, next. So back to surrender. Surrender is helping you to remove that control, right? Really having faith in the process, really trusting that intuition because um, when you're getting the idea and maybe it's a little baby idea, we wanna be really careful of who we're talking to about some of the ideas because um, they might not see it because it's not their idea, it's, it is your idea, right? So just be aware of that. And then we have the beautiful oil, believe. And believe is really like, I've experienced where people, and this kind of goes back to that limbic center of the brain, like you're automatically not necessarily going to just believe everything's gonna work out perfectly if you're in a, a shit show, literally. Um, but believe will help you to kind of relax. And when you are relaxed, you're able to move forward on something. Right, have you guys um, ever tried to force uh, like a, a, a screw or, or you're trying to like, yeah, you're, you're trying to screw something in or uh, you're just working on something and you're like, oh, I just need to get this done. And then something breaks, right? Have you ever, it's pretty inevitable, something breaks because you're literally trying to force something and it's not working out. So, we wanna make sure that we are relaxed and we, that we believe in ourselves. So believe is a beautiful blend. This is another oil that I like to use every single day and really um, help me to believe and feel amazing. So uh, again, dilution's not required. You can apply two to four drops, except for if you have really sensitive skin. Um, with that, I would also say it goes back to toxins. Look at the ingredients of the things that you're using because essential oils will fight those toxins that get stored in the fatty tissues of your cells. So we wanna make sure that we are using non-toxic products and I'm happy to chat with anyone more about that. And we're gonna refocus on helping you envision. So believe, you can have believe going in your diffuser. You can put believe on the back of your neck. So you can take a drop of, I uh, believe it also actually has balsam fir in it, which is really good if you have uh, any sort of 
like if your neck's kind of kinked up or I snowboard a lot. So believe with that balsam fir in it is really good for my muscles before I snowboard, especially that first time of the year. Because no matter how much you train and you do things, snowboarding is just, it's a little different. It's going to use, it's, you're reintroducing those muscles. When I use Believe, though, before I go out and after, my, my next day, I feel amazing. So Believe has Grand Fur, Coriander, Bergamot, Frankincense, Idaho Blue Spruce, Ylang Ylang, and Geranium. Also, I have Believe on a little roller cap. So uh, again, this is, I mean, it's just for purposes, like I do like to drop my oils a lot so they get into the um, energy center, right? But rolling it on, if it's going to be better for you to roll on, grab some roller fitments, make it easy for you, right? Whatever is easiest for you. So if you're like, oh, cool, I can just roll that on. I like that. Then voila, grab you some roller caps. Uh, they're called, actually, they're called a, Aroma Glides Fitments, Aroma Glide Fitments, if I believe, or Roller Fitments, that I believe is the, well, just a pet Aroma Glide, and it should pop up when you're searching on the Young Living website. So a question that I want you guys to ask yourself, what do you really want? Some of you do have some great goals, but really make sure that it's really what you want. And how do you want to live your life? Um, and you can you can reflect more on this in 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 the next twenty to thirty minutes after my presentation. Um, but really, like think about like if it's something like maybe it's a a big dream, right? That you want to achieve in the next five years. Well, that might be a little scary, right? That's why we use that valor. But how can you break it down into smaller bites? and also see yourself from that big dream. So uh, I believe that a applying believe is gonna help you set that foundation of getting into envision, envisioning. Envision is really a beautiful essential oil blend. There is a blend called Envision that really helps you to envision your future and to really see it the way you want it. Making sure, though, that you're aware of your thoughts. What are you emotionalizing with? How are you feeling about your goals, right? Like, again, think about that. How are you feeling about your goals? What are you feeling? Are you feeling it's going to be super fun? Are you excited about the journey? Do you have that enthusiasm? Are you into the spirit of it? Or are you just like, um, yeah, that's okay. I kind of want to do that, but I don't know how. And that's okay if you're in that emotion of, well, I don't know how, and maybe it will be a little hard. That's how these essential oils can help you. Like I said, they can help you relax and start getting into that action because with envisioning, that's the first aspect, right? Believe is another part of that. Envisioning and then believing that you can achieve it as well as really doing the things, acting like that person, seeing it the way you want it. Uh, again, this all goes with mindset. Bob Proctor's great. You can ask me about basics. Basics is amazing. Really studying your mindset and being aware of that. So envision is just going to help you, like I said, open up that creativity. And you can dilute one drop with one drop of these six. I know that this one, I'm just going to beautifully smell out of the bottle because I am patiently waiting for my envision to come the actual essential oil. I've been really already focused a lot on my goals. So black spruce, black spruce really helps your, um, the rest of these oils root into you to help you move into that vision to really tap into uh, and get rid of any old programming. Geranium, orange, lavender, sage, and rose are the other ones. And rose actually has a higher frequency and this beautiful bottle is $19, which is just amazing. 85 to 100 drops, such a beautiful price. Uh, and also with envisioning, right? Some of you, like I said, 
I am not really going to spend time uh, talking about cutting up stuff. I have some stuff cut up already. We can do that together as a group for those of you live, for those of you watching the replay. I highly encourage you um, to take the time and do that, right? Uh, for, for now, together as a group, we can decide if we want to do that after I'm almost done. I got a few more oils. The next oil is joy. We, uh, we well, one, whatever you're envisioning, I hope you're definitely enjoying, right? But we want to make sure that we have joy along this journey. So this is not only to tap into creating your vision book, creating your goals, right? Creating your new self-image. Like I said, go watch that video on self-image from Earl Nightingale. Super important. Uh, we want to make sure that we continuously enjoy the journey. Even the things that kind of, uh, they might not be a little, um, they might be a little uh, frustrating, right? There might be moments of frustration or, uh, which frustration is also unmet expectations. So make sure whenever you're frustrated that you communicate with that person or persons and what it is that you need to, what it is that needs to change. So joy is also a part of the great day protocol as well as valor and harmony. So I should have a video on the great day protocol. If not, feel free to message me about that. Uh, for those of you live, we can chat about that. So joy, I like to apply joy on my heart chakra. And this is another beautiful bottle that is coming in. There we go. Beautiful drop of joy. Um, and joy is also another oil that's really helped me with my grief of unexpectedly losing uh, my brother Santiago, who was, who was 14. And just, we never really know, you guys. This is why we're envisioning our future. We're acting like the person we want to be calm so we can really be attractive and attract the people that are going to just, well, one, probably inspire us, but and so that we can be inspiring and two, just help us to move on that vision, right? So I hope you guys are envisioning some of the people that, and character or characteristics, maybe not the physical people, but um, take some time to really envision the characteristics of the, the people that you want to be surrounded with. How do you want them to make you feel, right? Probably encouraged, joyful, joy, right? Um, fun, loving, caring, motivated, uh, especially a lot of you on here are business owners. So you definitely need some motivated people on your team and just uh, focus on that, right? Uh, helpful, you know, good, great at their job, get those characteristics in. And then also uh, make sure you have those characteristics because we attract what we are. So we gotta be very aware of what are we doing and how are we doing and acting. I also want to see if I can um, read that. Nope, I can't easily read that. So I'm gonna move forward. I will respond to that in a hot minute after I, um, Easily, I think, I think I can easily do that. Yeah, perfect. Okay, so the next oil is motivation. And we wanna make sure that we're motivated to take action, right? You're motivated to create your vision book or your vision board. You're motivated to really think about your goals. Some of you already have them that are on this Zoom, which is amazing. Super perfect to, to helping already have some goals, but really um, tap into those goals and make sure uh, that you are seeing yourself there, right? In that success in creating that business. And um, a lot of the time we get caught up as humans on the how, well, how is this going to happen? Like you have that big goal and you're like, well, I don't know how it's going to happen. I don't know what it, I mean, my, my plan is to have it done in five years, but what if it takes 10? So it takes 10, you keep the vision, you, and you continuously envision and you learn and you grow. It's like Edison said um, one, uh, during one of his interviews and he was trying to embed, invent the battery, like invent um, the storage cell. And he had to take, and he was really famous already at this time. 
and he had failed 10,000 times. Well, that's how the reporter saw it. The reporter had asked him, well, how does it feel to be one of the most successful men, one of the most successful scientists, and you fail 10,000 times? And he's like, no, I didn't fail 10,000 times. This, this just has more than 10,000 steps. That's a pretty cool way to see it. So I hope you guys can really find the truth in that and see your goal like that. So motivation, um, you can apply this whenever you feel lack of motivation, right? Uh, you can, so this could be, maybe you don't need it. Maybe you're like, oh, I love cutting out and making collages and this vision book and really spending time with my imagination. You might need this more after you're done, right? To help you really envision your success and be motivated to take those actions. Because it's not just the envisioning, you have to also act. Um, and that's kind of the where the acting as the person you intend to become, act as it now so that you're attracting all the right things and people to achieve that goal. So motivation is such a beautiful essential oil. You can apply it uh, topically. That's usually how I do it. And with motivation, I um, usually apply it sometimes to the bottom of my, of my feet or again, more to my wrists. So when I'm moving around, my hands around because I do that when I'm talking or, or like just, you know, picking something up, it'll help set into that aroma again. Because this, um, these essential oils, because they are so quality, they're, they're the highest quality ever. They stay on like the whole day. I mean, I do apply oils throughout the day, but it's so interesting. I sometimes it's been hours and people are like, what do you have on? I'm like, oh my God, it's been hours. I mean, or that's like what I'm thinking. I don't sell them that. Sometimes I do, but I might be like, uh, I think I probably put on Valor and Harmony today. I have to kind of think about it because it's been a while. Um, so Roman chamomile, black spruce, ylang ylang, and lavender are in motivation. Again, you can totally look that up on Young Living's website, which for YouTube, it's in the comments below. And you dilute one drop with one drop of V6 to apply it topically or just put it in your diffuser, right? You can set a timer and just put it on for 30 minutes, keep it off for a little bit and put it on again for 30 minutes, or you can just let it continuously go, it's up to you. But motivation is great. So this is going to inspire you to motivate. So we're gonna actually end with whatever oils that you have and or choose to have, because maybe you're like, oh man, I'm gonna get all these oils. Well, perfect. I mean, yes, 2022 is starting in three or four days, whatever that timeline is. Um, but every day is a new day. Every week is a new week, right? Like, let's really just be like, okay, and learn from any experience, right? So we're going to end with valor, with our courage oil, with our valor to help us have courage to move forward to act on our visions, to act on our goals, to really set in and work on this vision book, work on this vision board. And um, this is one of the oils I use every day. So highly recommended. I hope you guys can see the importance of using essential oils throughout the day, because a lot of these oils can also, when you feel like you're frustrated um, or annoyed, or lack of, lack and, lacking patience, because all of that is kinking the hose. Think of a hose. Um, we're trying to pull that hose to get it unkinked doesn't work. You have to go back and unkink the hose, right? So if you're frustrated, if you're angry, all of those emotions are on the side of fear, uh, then you're not gonna get to your goal. You have to be on the side of love, faith, right? Faith. Those are the, really the two bases of emotion is fear and faith. So I want to make sure we're on the side of faith, gratitude, joy, love, harmony, right? And uh, we really want to take our time and respond to things. So, and can you see that joining my team is just going to be an amazing experience? I love to help empower you. I'm happy to send samples as well as just chat out and create a wellness plan for you guys. 
and to really talk about and look at your ingredients you're using. It's just such a beautiful thing. And then can you see the value of jumping on and using these every day? So you're probably gonna need a subscription, which we'll talk about in a second. Um, but just start using them. If you're like, hey, I just wanna experience the valor and the harmony, perfect. That's a great place to start. If you're like, oh, I'm going all in, I'm gonna start with all these oils. And what are some of the toxic products or, or the product Thieves Household Cleaner will literally remove all of your cleaning, your toxic cleaning products. Um, and then add Thieves Laundry Soap and you're, you're perfect. The laundry soap is so important. You wear your clothes, when it, they're getting washed, you're, you're smelling that, right? So it's just, it's a good thing to remove those toxic ingredients. And we have a Thieves Laundry Soap. So that is non-toxic as well as the Thieves House Home Cleaner. And there's a little tip to extend our laundry soap, which uh, watch another video or we'll chat about that. So how to join. Literally, you can grab one oil on a subscription and that subscription can be every month every two months or every three months. And you can change your essential oil or you can grab all of these oils, which are gonna be over a hundred dollars, a hundred PV. I think it would be like 190, which will get you some gifts with purchases, which is awesome. And when you grab all of those oils, you're gonna also get a free shipping because it's over a hundred PV. And um, yeah, like I said, I'm pretty sure it's 190 PV. It'll be perfect, get some free gifts. The other thing that I have been using, which there is a video you can look up on my YouTube channel is the Divine Destiny Collection. I use this every day. So um, adding that to anyone who's like, oh, well that sounds really cool and calls to you. Uh, that's over a hundred PV. You can grab that and get the free shipping um, and, and or start on a subscription. So yeah, that is it. That is my beautiful presentation on envisioning. Really to follow, uh, to end it as well, make sure you're emotionalizing with where it is that you wanna go. The goals, achieving those goals, having that affirmative power and moving forward with all of that. I hope that you are doing that. And thank you guys so much for those of you watching the replay on YouTube. And I look forward to just helping those of you live on Zoom. So. Have a great one, YouTubers. Bye-bye.